Hey y'all, I've gotten this quite a few times and it's okay. People saying, we need to see your hair before we buy your products or we need to see your hair before we schedule an appointment with you. We need to see your hair before we believe anything. And I understand that. They like, we can, can we see your hair journey? I posted it. If you on my TikToks or my Instagram, I've already posted my, uh, my journey. Also, if you're my digital hair care community, you really see it. But like I told y'all before, because it's no secret, for years, I was not practicing what I preach, just like a lot of uh, other hairstylists. That's what we do sometimes. I ain't going to say all of us. I was neglecting my hair because I wanted the quickest thing. I was not... I didn't have patience for my hair. I would do whatever fast. I would skip out on my, my treatment, everything, just because I'm on a rush. I'm a, I was in a rush, but really, I just needed a hairstylist so that I could just sit in somebody's chair, and then they could just do my hair. And that's what I have now. Yes, I use my products. Yes, I did two big chops, one in July 2022 and one in October, but not a super big chop in October last year. So, yes, I'm in the process of growing my hair back out, and if you're in my community, you will see it. But what I will say is don't get don't get tricked out of your spot because at the end of the day, no matter what I do to me, I've changed thousands of hair lives, thousands. And y'all know I got all receipts, all the receipts. 